We got John uh, Caparulo. I think I said that right. Um, just for laughs, 2006. So you can tell like, we, this is a comedy one, man. So we're going to go ahead on and jump into it, man. See what old John got going on here, man. Gonna sound on for y'all. Let's get it. Caparulo! Caparulo. Yeah! How are you? Good. All right. Yeah. <laughs> Everybody's such a know-it-all. You know, I'm sick of I'm sick of people who read. Because <laughs> they think they know everything, all right? And there's some stuff I just don't want to know, all right? I don't care. <laughs> like, everybody I know is a nutrition expert now, and that's fine, all right? If you want to be on a health kick, fine, all right? If you want to live to your 190, fine, all right? If that involves no butter, fuck off, all right? All right, all right, all right don't ruin butter. Butter's good. <laughs> I'll put butter on Skittles, all right? I don't care, all right? Leave, leave butter alone. Huh? Like, I can't eat fast food anymore. Remember when McDonald's was fun? <laughs> hey, you go to McDonald's. Yay, hey, McDonald's. Not now. Now it's a guilt trip. You know what's in that? Uh, goodness. I don't know. I don't care, right? <laughs> I'm not doing research on a sandwich, all right? If you... Boy, my man said that it's a guilt trip now. That's what he said, a guilt trip? Oh, no. Like, I can't eat fast Hold on. I'll lift your 190. But I don't ruin butter. Butter's good. <laughs> I'll put butter on Skittles, all right? I don't care. All right? Leave, all leave butter alone. Like, I can't eat fast food anymore. Remember when McDonald's was fun? <laughs> hey, you go to McDonald's. Yay, hey, McDonald's. Not now. Now it's a guilt trip. You know what's in that? Uh, goodness. I don't know. I don't care. All right? <laughs> I'm not doing research on a sandwich, all right? If you pull into McDonald's, you pretty much decided. You know what? The hell with... My 70s, all right? I don't care, all right? I don't, I don't, that's not even real cheese. Well, it's playing the part, all right? So if it ain't cheese, it's cheese's stunt double, all right? Just leave my lunch alone, all right? I don't need abs, dude, all right? I need salt and pickles and stuff, all right? And a Coke, all right? <laughs> and that bothers me, too, all right? I don't know if you have this problem in Canada. I am sick of this. Here's my political crusade, all right? It's 2006. Can we just get along? Can we just have Coke and Pepsi in the same building? Is it that big a deal? Do we have to draw a line everywhere? Yeah, exactly. Every time I go to a restaurant, what would you like to drink? Can I have a Coke? Oh, is Pepsi okay? Is Monopoly money okay? Because no, all right? <laughs> <laughs> pushing stuff nobody wants, all right? Stop pushing stuff nobody likes, all right? Like orange popsicles. <laughs> nobody likes them, all right? Put the grape and the cherry in there and seal the box, all right? Nobody likes the orange, all right? I mean, I mean, orange is good, right? I, I, I like the orange ones. Who don't like the orange ones? Y'all don't like the orange ones? I mean, I, I rock with the orange ones, man. Grape is my favorite, but... If they got orange, I, I mean, I, I rock with that too, you know? What he likes, all right? Like orange popsicles. <laughs> Nobody likes them, all right? Put the grape and the cherry in there and seal the box, all right? Nobody likes the orange, all right? Orange ain't gonna catch on, all right? Nobody likes it. Because that's what happens. You eat the grape and the cherry first and all you got left is orange. And your mom's not gonna buy new popsicles because why didn't you finish the last box? Because all we got is punk ass orange, all right? That's why I need the last box, because orange sucks. Well, I'm not buying new pops. It goes, well, there goes my whole freaking summer then, doesn't it? <laughs> I'm saying, I wish I'd tell, I wish I was, I talked about more important stuff. Like, I wish I could tell jokes, like, about the president, but I don't know shit. <laughs> <laughs> Is that bad? Do like, it. I don't care. People guilt trip me all the time. She was pushed that today to see a speech? No. <laughs> How could you miss that? I guess I got more channels than you do, dude, because... Uh, <laughs> It was not Nickelodeon, all right? I don't care, all right? I'm watching Spongebob, all right? Shut up. <laughs> I don't care, dude. I watch dumb stuff on TV. I get pulled in, you know? I get pulled in by Discovery. They own me, dude. You know what they get me with is Loch Ness every time. Loch Ness, searching for Loch Ness again. And I know I'm going to be disappointed at the end of the show. Every show ends the same way. We didn't find anything, all right? <laughs> <laughs> I haven't been watching anything for a while. Yeah, like, they do suck you in like that, though. Like, they have it making it seem like, oh, we just found something or something that we seen. And, oh, nah, that, that ain't what it is, bro. Bro, you talking about aggravating, bro. Aggravating, man. Again. And I know I'm going to be disappointed <laughs> at the end of the show. Every show ends the same way. We didn't find anything. All right. <laughs> I haven't been watching anything for a while. 
I've been watching anything for a while. You ever have this problem? My cable went out like six weeks ago, and I'm screwed. <laughs> you ever have this problem? The cable goes out, and the cable company just doesn't care. I called him. I'm like, yeah, I got fuzz. Can you do something? Well, we can't come out tonight. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> we can come out on Monday between 10 a.m. and Thursday. You're going to be home. <laughs> Then they ask you dumb questions, too. Like, you ever get on the phone with customer service and they ask you the dumbest stuff possible? Is your TV plugged in? I will freaking stab you. <laughs> Yo, that part. Bruh. Those type of questions like, are you, si man, you serious? How do you think I can see the fuzz? Like, there's nothing on it. Like, nothing coming through the TV. TV is on. Electricity there. It's y'all problem. Stop making it trying to seem like it's something on my end. No, it's y'all. Then they ask you uh. dumb questions, too. Like, you ever get on the phone with customer service and they ask you the dumbest stuff possible? Is your TV plugged in? I will freaking stab you. <laughs> <laughs> who, who unplugs the TV ever? You plug it in once and it stays that way till you move, all right? <laughs> Thanks. <laughs> I gotta go. That's my time. Thanks, you guys. Thanks. Oh, man. Yo, he is not lying, bro. Like, they ask some of the dumbest things that... It's like they train to ask stupid stuff. I mean, like... I, I didn't say that my TV's not working. I said the cable is not working. Like, there's nothing... All the channels is just black and white. What's going on? That's what I need to know, man. Ugh. That's crazy, man. Hey, I I enjoy John, man. I don't think I ever seen him or heard of this dude before, man. But I'm glad that I checked him out tonight, though. I'm glad I got introduced to him, man. So appreciate that. Thank you for that, man. Ugh. Oh, man. So look, y'all make sure that y'all hit that like button, man. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. You already know who it is. It's your boy vlogging with Greg, baby. I'm out. <laughs>